Yo, football season is back. Now, are y'all ready for some football? All my basketball people out there, listen, it's football time. We got foot, we got basketball in October, baby. We're going to be wait, waiting on until LeBron James chase to the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar ball record. We're going to be on full notice that night. We're going to we probably going to go live that night. But anyway, it's football time. It's this Sunday, all the big, everybody playing. I love week one because everybody playing. No bye weeks. Everybody playing. See, everybody on full display. You get to see how people look and what they're going to be. Week one, it ain't all of us. It ain't who gonna be the, the best team we won. You gotta wait until the season. Keep going. You gotta wait until the to, to more games played. But week one is a great indication. Let me start with let me start with some predictions. This is my MVP. I know I'm Tom Brady. I got M, I thought Tom Brady won MVP last season. I got Tom Brady won MVP. I think he got Julio, Chris Godwin, question mark. They can start with the game. I play the Cowboys. Listen, this is a this is a this is a a passing lead. You need weapons. Amari Cooper is gone. I don't trust CD Lamb. You get you only CD Lamb you show one now. You gotta have multiple options at the wide wide opposition. Cowboys don't have that. I'm taking I'm taking Tampa. Green Bay Vikings. Green Bay the Vikings. I'm taking I'ma take the Vikings week one. Cause they said LSR, the only player that Rogers familiar with, even though Ron Carman, he's kinda older now. No Devontae Adams. They're going to miss Devontae Adams, bro. We seen Thursday night what the Bills did. Reason why San Fran, reason why LA Rams was so great last night, great last year, because they had D. Jackson start off the season. Uh, still a, a, a burner. You had Cooper Cup. You had Robert Woods. And then you add, right when you add OBJ, you lose Robert Woods to injury, but OBJ step up. And you still have uh, Cooper Cup. And you still have, what's the other kid's name? Uh, Jefferson. And you had the tight end. So you had all these weapons on display. Cooper Cup was a triple crown leader. OBJ was part of the third best receiver. And you double team Cooper, or you, you can't double team Cooper that much because oh, you lead OBJ one on one, he gonna go to work. Now you don't have that. That's why you see him struggling so, and got their ass whooped against the Buffalo Bills, who are for real. They are for real. Them, them the Chargers and the Raiders. I, I, I like the Broncos too. But uh, let's get, let's get to the Broncos. I think the Broncos going to wax the Bron uh, Seattle ass. I, I love their defense. I love Russell. Let's ride. Uh, shout out to Seattle, baby. Uh, anyway, a big matchup too, the Raiders and Chargers. Now, that's one for me that I I, I, I got two playoff teams come out the AFC West. I want to say the Broncos, I love, I love Russell and everything he represents him. And what he, he, might just, he just might be that second, might be just the best quarterback in that position. Cause we gotta see how Patrick Mahomes play without Tyree Hill. We gotta see how he play without Tyree Hill. And they play Arizona, but I got I say Kansas City beat Arizona. No Hopkins for the first six weeks. They lost Christian Kirk. I'm going with KC. That Chargers and Raider game. I'm, I'm torn, man. Cause we got JC Jackson in the backfield with Darren James. You got Khalil Mack on one side, Joey Bosa on one side. Then you go to the offensive side. That boy Justin Herbert can throw that ball accurately on a dime. Any athletic like that throw he throw to Mike Williams. Just dropped in the back. I mean, that was one of the sweetest throws I've ever seen in my life. Uh, Keenan Allen, Mike Williams. You got Eckley in the backfield. I mean, they got pieces. They got great fits on both sides of the ball. And I just, I want to see how great Khalil might play. But then you go to the Raiders. You got the bunch of having the best raw receiver in football, in my opinion. That's why I think Green Bay going to struggle in Miley this season. You need that weapon. That's why Matthew Stafford you need more than just Cooper Cup. That's why I say KC gonna, ain't going to be the same without Tyreek. Because now you got to play different coverages. But as I say, you got Devontae Adams. They got uh, the other uh, white boy that's cold. You got one of the best tight ends in uh, Dan Wilder. Then you add, and then on defense, you add Chandler Jones. Chandler Jones to your defensive line. So they both, so, so all those players got, so Chargers and the Raiders got great pass rushers. So it just come it just it just come down to the quarterback position, and a lot of people say still picking Kansas City because they say Patrick Mahomes still the best player. He's gonna be more accurate with the ball because he ain't gotta try to feast feed the ball to Tyree downfield, try to go for them big bombs. He can spread the ball a lot more. But he do got he got he, they, they made up pretty nice for the loss of uh, Tyree Hill. You get Ellen Lazar, who's a burner. Not Ellen Lazar, I'm sorry. You get Mar uh, Marquez Scanley, 
from Green Bay, who's a Browner. You get Juju Smith from 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 uh, Steelers. Uh, you get you got uh, still got Kelsey. Kelsey still gonna be his number one option. Still, still top two, top three, top one best tight end, arguably best tight end in pro football. Still in this day, but you're gonna he gonna he gonna get a lot of doubles because he gonna go to him a lot. So he's gonna have to use Juju, Val Scanley, and the whole Harmon. Nicole Harmon can run, but he ain't no Tyree Hill. Ain't nobody know that. Tyree Hill take the Tyree take a five yard slant to take to the house. Ask the Buffalo Bills. Tyreek open up everything for everybody else on that team. So that's why I think they're gonna struggle. But first game of the season, I'm going with uh the Chiefs, because I don't like Arizona that much. Uh so that, that just a list of the big games I want to go. I'm, I'm I picked my MVP Tom Brady. I think he should have MVP last season. I think Aaron Rodgers will have a chance. I think Patrick Mahomes got a great narrative, but no, that AFC West is the best division. It's gonna be beating each other up. Uh, Josh Allen, yeah, of course, is is is, a, is one of the front runners. He's the favorite, but I'm going with Tom Brady. The narrative last last year, last year, all these weapons, he's gonna have a lot of red zone touchdowns because he got some big targets to throw the ball to. He's gonna be one of the most impressive throwing. So last year was a great throwing season. I think Tom Brady intercepting touchdown ratio is gonna be down because Bruce Aaron is not the coach no more. He got worried about no risky, no biscuit no more. He's going to do a lot of what he want to do since Tar Bowles is a defensive coach and he's the head coach. He's a defensive coach. So I think uh, Tom Brady and Brian Levels is going to run it off in way differently. And it's going to be a lot of less interceptions, a lot of still get the ball off fast, find an open guy, take some shots, back shoulder fades, throw the ball up, 50 feet balls because you got Mike Evans and Julio. Hopefully, one of the two going to get uh, not double team. Mike Evans say like, he want to get to see less doubles. So if you single coverage Julio and Lenny Fredette said he's back, Lenny Fredette on the team texted Sean McCoy and said, yo, he back. Julio Jones is back to being Julio. Then that we, the NFL got a problem. Or if you don't if you wanna if you want to single cover Mike Evans, that's a bigger problem. Cause we seen what he did to uh overrated Jalen Rose. Jalen Rose is getting exposed. Not Jalen Rose, Jalen Ram. Jalen Rose is getting exposed since the this division playoff round against Mike Evans. When he Tom Brady dropped that bomb. I want them to make it 27 or 20 when they, when they come back to that division around. They should have won Todd Bowles through that, through that game at the end. Still mad about Todd Bowles, but he got the head coach. And just, I don't know why he got it. Good guy. Uh, then he get exposed in the Super Bowl. Higgins. I think it's Higgins for the Bengals and uh, Chase got him. And then he get exposed last night with Diggs. I mean, the other night. Not, not last night. The other night. On Thursday night, he's just stealing money. I don't know what's going on with, with Jalen. That, now that people say he's still the best corner. Nick, people like fool like Nick Wright. And hey, listen, nothing Nick Wright said. Nick Wright got the Chiefs the favorite one in the Super Bowl every year. Only he got the Tampa Bay too much hype. Like Nick Wright is an idiot again when it comes to that. So defensive player of the year, I, I like Michael Parsons. I think he'll have a great season. Could be potential defensive player of the year. I ain't mad at that. Um, what else? What else? What, so that's the two. That's the two biggest awards. Super Bowl champions. I got Tampa Bay. I think Tampa Bay is the easily the best team. Green Bay not the same. No weapons. We seen we seen how the uh, the Rams look. They're not gonna be good. The offensive line was trash. No weapons. Matthew Stafford is Matthew Stafford like look like Detroit. Going to feast feed the ball to Cooper Cup. We need gonna need more than that to, to win in the air in NFC. Cowboys no weapons. You need weapons in the, in the NFL, bro. You need them. Uh, trust me, y'all watch. Y'all see. Don't listen to these fools on TV. Just watch. Just watch the NFL season. Uh. Who 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 was in the NFC can challenge? The Vikings got a lot of weapons. Justin Jefferson, I think the third best receiver in the NFL. Adam Thielen still over there. They got Dalvin Cook. The Vikings got a great roster. We got to see if first cousin get put it together. Can he actually put one great season together and put them over the top? Uh, they may they, they somebody they, they people wild card uh to make the Super Bowl of the NFC Championship game. Uh, you got it ain't really deep in the NFC, bro. Eagles, I like the Eagles to win the NFC East. I said it here. I like they roster, bro, top to bottom. Offensive, defense, best offensive line, one of the best defense line, that backfield with Slay. And then they got Garner, Garner, who, 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 who got a turn ready face last year because he made a play. Kicked them off, too, their first game they played them and sealed that game. Garner Johnson, I think it's Garner Johnson from the Saints. And they got Slay. And they got Devontae Smith. Of course, they traded for A.J. Brown. We just got to see if uh, Jalen Hurts can make that jump. But overall, we gonna see. Y'all like to subscribe. Oh, that's it.